How do you use a doodle or something like that? That's right. I know. They doodle everything now. That's my joke. Well, a long time ago, you 
like you really start. Yeah, girl, <laughs> probably 21. Wow! Oh, but a lot of now I keep it six. They had all trained with us. We were doing a lot of boarding back then too, which I tried to get rid of as much as possible. Mm. So they had all trained. It was actually not that bad because they were all trained. They were all very friendly dogs. Okay. I I mean it kind of because you still there's still different bathrooms. Sometimes <laughs> different it was one family with four dogs. With all their yeah. dogs, like the parents had dogs, all three kids had dogs, and they would go away on a vacation together and right, get all the dogs. Right. Then there was another family that would come and stay here in York mm -hmm. from somewhere else, and they would oh, they're a bring all their dogs, dogs here. here. That's yeah. why we got all the dogs at once. Mm -hmm. But we don't do that anymore. I take that week off now, too. It's my <laughs> week. You can release her. Good girl. Yes. Just in case they ask. Okay. Yeah. That's too many dogs. For some reason, my birthday week's a very busy week. It's not like July the 4th or anything. It's August 9th, so... Uh, it's, not, it's still a summer. Yeah. Which is nice. Now it's just nice to have that week off. Now it's just nice. Yeah. Busy, huh? my bud. <laughs> <laughs> she is. She's a baby. You're going to be a beast. She's adorable, though. Very good temperament. Is she? Yes. Nice. Very sweet girl. Very sweet girl. That's why I also have your dog around sweet dogs today. Almost as nice as me. Uh, <laughs> you can release her. Oh, yes. Dogs that aren't too challenging, you know? Yeah. Well, she is. She's just kind of with your training every day and getting her out to the parks and stuff is going to be key so just make sure you can get there and back safely yeah you know, i usually scan the area make sure i have a path in the path out yeah I, i'm aware of all the dogs that are around me and like i said i choose places when i'm with a dog like this um where the dogs are going to be on leash if they're out at all i make sure i hold my leash really firmly yeah you know or, or i have this one on that goes over my right. thing yeah yeah Yes. Yeah, even if I'm holding, if I have my dog on this though, you better be holding it right here or else they'll pull you right off balance. Uh huh. Yeah, yeah. she's you know, probably pretty your strong. Shoulder in your back. There's been times where it's taken my whole body, you know, to get her back in my control. Did you want me to bring another dog up here? No. Oh, I thought you said that was so good. Well, I might. Right now, we're just getting through the stays there. Speed rider. I don't think you ever put her in a set, so you no, know I'm sorry. I'm just trying to be done the extra. I'm just trying to check my chain she's running. Oh, boy. Okay. Sit. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. Well, yeah, you want the relationships to start be come between you and your dog yes. instead of you and the tree. The treat's helpful, like when we go in public, mm -hmm. I'll probably bring treats up the first time because that, like I said, tends to take their stress level way down. Right, right. It's not magical, but it, it helps. Right. <laughs> yeah, I make sure to have treats just in case right. I need to... Sit. And the 
other thing you want to do is just go slow with her at first, you know? Like the amount of time Like, uh, I wouldn't, like, bring her into a dog park. Right. I don't I, do you dog know, parks. Or on a city street right away to practice. Yeah. Or yeah. anything that's too much. Too much. That's <laughs> okay. That's why we're working on it. Don't get frustrated. Just put her back in the set. It's no biggie. She'll get it. You know, I guess for me too, like I do get frustrated because I'm like, we're, we've been working on this since November, but yeah. for her, we're now doing something new. Right. So it's not, you know, so I'm like, I can't believe you haven't got this yet. Where, you know, it's not been consistent right. for her either. Right. Because we were between. And like so I said, behavioral houses. problems are hard to trip away. If you, are, if you are ever on my blog, look up my dog Shane's story sometime. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. It's a long story. It began with the uh, town trying to close my business as we got our new puppy. And uh, so my mind was elsewhere. Because we had a land developer, that's why I was at next door, who didn't like that we didn't like that they were blocking the road. So they sick the town on us. And, oh, my God. They were like, yeah, it was, it was a two-year-old <laughs> deal. Not the time to have a working drive building the puppy, but I had gotten her b before it all started. And mm -hmm. uh, then my mind was uh, not where it should be, and she accidentally got attacked by another dog right in her fear. Yeah. Oh, yeah. man. Yeah. That's, so then, I'm pretty sure, what set her fear off. Yeah. The scrapple that she had young, yeah. when she was young, things started to change. That's what'll do it. Yeah. And it's hard to get through it. A lot of it's trust. You know, so like, uh, Shane is very good right now around. <laughs> the step hands are front paws, so I go, whoop, thank you, front paws. You can release her now. Oh. Okay. So a lot of it's getting them to trust you while you're out, so like, they're behind. I'm sure she knows they can't get at her, and a lot of it's her perception of it. So it doesn't matter that Izzy's a cute little fluff. Fluff monster, if she was out and about, she would probably see her as a potential threat. Absolutely. Absolutely. So we can think that Izzy's a great dog all we want to, but that doesn't matter because her perception is different. Her perception is I mean, she's little kids. Yeah. You know, like anything that is starting to come yeah. into her yeah. area is a potential threat. Right. And sometimes, I guess, you know, if it we go in the same loop, but we see a lot of the same people. So you can really start. Good girl. Yes. So if there's someone that I think she's kind of familiar yep. with, not so much. Right. But sometimes you see kids or something yep. that you don't normally see. Yep. And she's like, new kids threat. are twitchy. Same. You know? Kids are sometimes running and screaming and right. unpredictable. Unpredictable. That's true. And they have equipment on, right. helmets, yeah. and this and that, the other. <laughs> that she's just like, right. no, this is this is not right. Something is off. And you can release her. Good girl, yes. <laughs> the good it, stuff is you now. Being yeah. pleased with her, you're the good stuff. Yeah. When we invite people to, because they've done their work, that was the only caveat. Right. <laughs> Understood. Understood. Otherwise, it's way too much work, and it gets in the way of everyone's training. Right. And 
and you can release her. Then we just have her more. We have Robert coming back up, so let's see if we can get this. Here we go. Don't be scary, though. Making a lot of noise. No! So, 